Speaking of Boca Chica, my last news item for the week is uh, just kind of giving you guys an update on where Boca Chica's at. Did they, they finally get of... an Applebee's? <laughs> if, if, not, if not, I'm not, not going. That's it. Well, they are working on that little restaurant, which is cool. <laughs> but we are seeing um, a lot more stuff uh, stacking for super heavy. So Elon says that the rings are thicker than they need to be for the... So, I was asking Elon on Twitter, you know, what's the difference like between the Starship stuff and um, Super Heavy? You know, are they using the same thickness of steel or do this the Super Heavy you'd think would need to be thicker steel to be able to support all the weight of Starship and Super Heavy? But Elon said the rings are thicker than they need to be for now um, on Starship, basically. So the same thickness works for the booster and the ship um, for hoop stress. Booster lower tank will have long, longitudinal stiffeners to prevent buckling. So there will be additional stiffeners on the inside of the lower tank to be able to support the weight of everything on top of it um, eventually. But we're seeing it actually built out. And um, and Elon, you know, I, I'm trying to find where this was, but Elon basically said that, uh, that uh, Starship update will be in three weeks. So hopefully by the time we're almost two weeks now. So we should see the Starship update by the end of this year or by the end of this month. Um, and he mentioned that, uh, it'll probably take, uh, I don't even see where we're at now, but I'll just give you guys just <laughs> screw Twitter. Um, basically he's thinking that these, these high bay will be done in a couple weeks and then without the full blown Gantu crane inside, but they can then start stacking the super heavy booster, which we're already seeing ring sections for. So there's a chance that, uh, by the end of the month or the first part of November, we will see a fully stacked starship. Super heavy booster, sorry, the, just the super heavy booster, which I'm thinking personally, the event, the Starship event update will wait until that's done. I think last year, you know, he stood in front of the Mark One prototype. This year, I think he wants to be standing and doing the presentation in front of super heavy booster. It just makes sense to me, you know. Or stack the whole thing up. So, that would be insane. I mean, if if they already have, you know. The, the pieces for, I mean, how many were they at? 11 now? Right. Well, 11, they're working I mean? on 12 already. Serial number 12. Yeah. yeah. So you're, I mean, they absolutely could. I just don't know. It might be halfway faked or, you know, have to be suspended by a crane. Well, of course. A bit. It's just for show. The yeah. first one was just for show. Yeah, totally. So we're seeing, so serial number eight has been working on its cryo proofing at the moment. It seems like they're working on another test again. They kind of are not quite reaching the metrics they need to reach before they install Raptors. But serial number eight is the first one with the, the flappity Ilanaron, the, the rear fins on it. Um, so we're seeing progress there. Once that's done, we'll hopefully see the Raptors installed and do a static fire. Once they do a static fire, we'll see the nose comb put on and test it out one more time, and then we'll see it hop. So as soon as uh, I'm, I'm going to be targeting to try to get down there for the static fire and probably stay there until it hops. So I might be spending a full month in Texas at this point or however long it takes between static fire and hop. But I'm going to be very committed to that. So, so when you say hop, is this the 15 kilometer one, or are they going to do like a little short one, like we've already seen, and then go higher? They're going straight for 15, is my understanding. Okay. And and you according can, to Elon uh, on Twitter, check in anytime you like, but you can never leave. <laughs> <laughs> now, so they they did um, cryo testing last night, right? Yep on on Wednesday night and Tuesday night, base or wait, yeah, Wednesday night and Tuesday night, they've been working on cryo proofing, but it looks like they're still. As of the recording of this, I'm working on another test again on Thursday night um, until they, they, you know, they might be having to fix little spots that are leaking and not holding up to the full pressure. So mm -hmm. um, once they pass cryo, then yeah, they'll install Raptors and simultaneously we're seeing them finish up the high bay and they'll start stacking super heavy and somewhere here near the end of the month, we should hopefully get an update. And Elon was saying on Twitter that this update this time will be like Starship version one. Because what we've been seeing in the past is literally just kind of concepts, rough ideas. You know, even last year, we we're still seeing like a more fleshed out idea, but they hadn't quite figured out. But he's now saying like, this is pretty much like we have it down. We we know what we're going to be building. We know what we're going to be testing. Um, we are into actual Starship version one. And uh, that's what we're, they're going to be showing it us this year at the Starship update is like, here's what we have figured out and here's what we're going to be producing. So, um yeah, so that's cool. That's epic. Yeah, that is. I mean, that's that's the future. That's like that is the definition of our ludicrous future. Is 
dozens of starships being built, <laughs> you know, in a year. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching this clip from our show. If that's just not enough for you and you want to watch the full episode, you can go to olfpod.com slash YT. And if you want more from us, you can consider becoming a Patreon member. You'll get early access to episodes. You can join our awesome community. You can actually watch us record live and get your name in the credits by going to olfpod.com slash Patreon. So thanks everyone for watching. Check back every Friday for new clips here and new episodes on the main channel. Thanks, everybody.